I hope you find the video funny in the start, but you know this is not the problem. How many times have you been in this uh, situation? How many times? In a need of a remote control to take a remote photo or to, ta or to take a remote video and not having it? How many times? and going back and forward to the camera, back and forward to the camera to test if you are in the frame, if everything is okay, if the settings are okay. Now, you don't have to do that anymore. You know why? Because small rig think of us. And what did they send us? That's a secret we're gonna see right now. Let's go. I want you to know that the remote control that I'm using from the day that I bought the camera was this JJC remote control that it's not working 50 to 70% of the times that I'm using it and pressing all these buttons because it's an IR remote control and it's never, never working, never. And I'm getting frustrating and I'm, I'm getting really, really irritating by this uh, Ah, control, this control. So, Small Rig approached us with the best solution that we can have now with a Bluetooth remote control and a shooting grip all together and tripod and everything all in one. So guys, let's open the box. I think that Small Rig company doesn't need introductions. I have made enough videos with this company that sent me a lot of things and I tested and I reviewed them and I think it's a, it's a fantastic company. It makes hundreds of small accessories for cameras and f for mobiles and for everything. You should visit their site. I'm absolutely sure you're going to find something uh, very interesting inside their site. So they think of us and they send us this um, wireless shooting grip. Let's go open the box. First of all, let's see what it says here. It can be used as a tripod for live streaming. It can pan 360 degrees. It can tilt 180 degrees. And it has an extendable stick. Like a selfie stick, eh? Nice. Very clever. Up to 15 centimeters or 5.9 inches. And it has also a detachable remote control. Let's go see it. So this is it, this foam package, some instructions, how you're going to use it, how you're going to connect it. The compatibility for the shooting grip is quite big. It has a small list here. It has a list about some Sony cameras and some Canon cameras like ZV-1, ZV-10, all the 6 series, all the 7 series cameras of uh, Sony and some Canon M6, M15, M200, EOS R5, R6 and stuff like that. The most common and usable cameras we have now, we're using, everybody's using right now. And this is the grip. This, ladies and gentlemen, is the shooting grip. It has inside this cable. So, this is the grip. It has this lock mechanism. As I told you, it can tilt 180 degrees. You see that? By pressing this button here, it has a friction mechanism here, very stable. And you know, by the time I, I got in my hand, it's very sturdy, it's very, very robust. It's, it's very nice. It looks very nice. It has these two legs here to use it as a tripod and as I told you, it has a button here in the ball head 
that it can rotate, you can rotate depending on where you want it. You can rotate this ball head 360 degrees from this button here. Mollery Company says that the material of uh, this shooting grape is from high strength nylon and glass fiber, detachable remote control. You see that? So let's see the functions that we have here. Let's come a little bit closer. It has a button for zoom, for zooming the camera. It has a shutter button for camera, a shutter button for video. It has the on-off function and a custom key, like the Sony cameras. You can uh, customize this key in which way you like it. So I've been using this uh, shooting grip about a week now and I would like to tell something because I, I would like to be honest with this shooting grip. Um, it's very good. It can hold uh, my camera, my Sony a6400 with all my lenses, my 18 to 135, my Sigma 16 millimeter and my Sony 85 uh, millimeter that are very heavy lenses. Uh, it can hold it. It can hold it very nice. This shooting grip can uh, help you a lot. It can help you a lot. It can untie your hands very much. And as I told you, shooting grip has a long selfie stick about 15 centimeters long and you can lock your camera like this. I'm gonna show you later through some videos I have and I'm gonna show you how it's working. On the side of the, of the remote control, it has also a type C to charge your wireless remote control, this detachable remote control. Maximum payload when the shooting grip is like this, fold it, it's 1.5 kilos. 1.5 kilos. And when you extend the selfie stick, it's zero, uh, 0 0.5 kilos, half a kilo. So I can tell you for sure that it can handle more than uh, half a kilo, but please do not try it. Eh? Do not try it. I'm, I'm trying it already. I'm putting about uh, eight, 900 grams about in, uh, in payload here and I didn't have any problem at all. And you have this lock mechanism here, so you can lock your camera. So, this is our Sony A6400 and this is our shooting grip from Small Rig. And now I'm gonna demonstrate to you how we are gonna connect it via Bluetooth, the grip with the camera. How we connect them. So, we open our camera. We're going to menu in section three. Do you see that? In section three, Bluetooth settings, we put Bluetooth function on and pairing. We open the grip here and we press the record button plus the custom one button simultaneously. Connected. Do you see that? Connected. SR RG1. Okay. And now we are connected. The next thing we're gonna do is we will go to aperture mode. Basically we're finished. We don't have anything else to do. So we're going to aperture mode to take a photo. We press the shutter button. Do you see that? Easy. If you press it halfway, you produce focus. It makes focus of the camera. And then all the way you take a photo. By pressing the record button, you start the recording. Very handy, very easy. Thank you, Small Rig, for this. Very easy, guys. What do you think? I want to add that uh, Small Rig was kind enough to send me this beautiful 
metal cage for my Sony A6400 with this rubber grip, rubber hand grip here, finger grip. It's very nice. This is an item that I wanted so much, long time now, and finally I have it in my hands. I put it my camera. I attach my camera immediately. So I'm very happy with this because it has this cold shoe mount adapters to put my camera, to put my microphones, and to put also this mini top handle that they send to us like this. I have done a lot of videos with uh, small rig accessories. You better check it out in the in their site and please uh, make a subscribe and a thumbs up, give a thumbs up if you like the video so far. So we continue. This was the connection between the camera and the shooting grip. Very easy. So, as I have told you guys, I have a little secret and my secret is that I found out that this remote control can still work with GoPro. You can have one remote control for both devices. I think separately, it cannot control both in, in the same time, but this is amazing. Uh, when I found out, uh, I was so crazy and so happy about this. So. Same process. What I did, I went to the menu of my GoPro. Here, connections, wireless connections on, connect device, the remote, same procedure, say one and the record button. And I think it's connected. So if we go So if we go to the photo and we try to take a photo Took a photo, video. It started video. Do you see that? And stop. Photo. Processing raw. Do you see that? Wonderful thing. Wonderful thing. Now I have a remote for my GoPro. Um, I was gonna buy it, a remote control, the remote control that has the GoPro that has all the moves and all the things and all the buttons, but. Uh, I, I think I can get used to this. I don't have any problem at all. The only thing that you have to keep in mind is uh, that this remote control does not have too many buttons and too many functions. Um, this is one thing. And the second one that's not so important for me is that sometimes it, it can be detached uh, from the handle here because the magnet is not so strong, but just keep it in mind. It's not a drawback. But just keep it in mind, okay? So, this is the remote control. And let's go outside eh, to see how we can take selfie videos with our camera and this shooting grip and with our selfie stick. So, we're right outside. We took a walk to see how this system works. I'm keeping handheld my camera, my Sony A6400 with my, with my lens 18 to 135. And on top, I have the mini top handle from Small Rig. So uh, pretty heavy, pretty heavy setup. And I'm using it and I'm holding it uh, pretty sturdy and pretty robust. And it's amazing. Now. I put my selfie and I keep, I give distance to my camera. That's the wonderful thing with a 50 centimeter extended selfie stick that uh, this grip has. 
So with my selfie stick extended, I want uh, I would like to take a video to see how stabilized this can be. Right now, holding handheld my camera and keeping everything extended like this. So, what's your opinion? What do you think about this shooting grip? I believe it's amazing. Small rig made a fantastic product for us and I'm using it every day from the day that came to my hands and thank you so much Small Rig for uh, sending this product to us to review it and test it. Wonderful, amazing wireless shooting grip that I'm using right now, handheld. Very clever of them. Small rig was very clever of them uh, to start build uh, such an accessory for our cameras. Very clever. I like it very much. Uh, I'm gonna tell you the truth. I'm gonna use it more and more every day. Uh, I'm getting used to it. So you better buy one like this. But for sure, you you're gonna need it. You're gonna need it. It will untie your hands many times if you need remote control and and somewhere to stand your camera like this here. A kind reminder that all the products that you see and many other products that I'm using and my gear and everything, you're gonna find them down below in my description. You better go and check them out and I'm pretty sure if you go to their site, in the smaller rig site, you're gonna find many things interesting. I'm pretty sure about this. They have hundreds of accessories for cameras and mobiles. You're gonna find a lot of things, a lot of things. I'm pretty sure about that. So go down below, check them out. A subscription to my channel will be kindly appreciated. Um, give a thumbs up if you like the video so far. Check my other videos in my channel. I think you're gonna find something interesting. You know, my channel is all about tech and reviews and unboxing of very interesting things and, and drone footages. So you better check out my channel. If you have any questions, leave them down below in the comment section. Till next video, aloha. Bye.